Hey everybody, this is Rod from Bent Rods Guiding and Fishing and uh, Bent Rods Tackle Company. And uh, here I am just uh, going through my jig box right now. I'm uh, going to show you a little bit about how my jigs look. Uh, so here's my case. You can see it's pretty, uh, it's pretty messy right now. And what happens is when I'm hiking and climbing and I'm pretty physical when I fish, so the box bangs around and these, some of the jigs, you know, they uh, come out of the foam and they all get clumped together. So usually what I'll do when I get home at the end of the day is I'll check, make sure that I didn't put any wet ones back in because for starters, you don't want to put wet jigs back in your box. You want to keep them out, keep them in your shirt or your hat or whatever to the end of the day, wash them up, clean them, dry them, then put them back. So yeah, so once in a while I'll just take my box, open it up and just sort of resort things. And I always, I try to keep mine fairly, uh, you know, color coded and you know, I have all my pink ones here, all my worm jigs there and try to be organized with it. That way when you open it on the river, you're, it's a lot easier to make that decision when you can actually see the jigs, they're nicely placed. You can see that there's, this one's a bit dirty there, it's gotten, uh, my box is pretty dirty. It's probably time to take all, take them all out, clean them all up, and uh, clean up my box, and then dry it up, and then start over. 